Hey, hey, hey guys, it's Jess, and in this video, I've already washed my face, but I'm going to another update for Mary Kay uh, Pink Clay Mask. So let's get into that video. Now first, before we start off, I already washed my face, obviously. This pimple came, and it's annoying. I already popped this one like a long time ago, earlier in the week. I think that's all the pimples I have on my face, but my face is like so soft. After washing it, after washing it, I love it. But um, this is what my face looks like after I washed it. Now, before we get into the video, um, one of the veterans won bingo and he didn't know what to do with this because he's a male. I guess he doesn't like, doesn't do anything with his feet. It's poor say. So he asked my mother-in-law if um, he has a daughter and she's like, yes. So then he's like, here, give this to her. <laughs> and it's because um, he didn't know what to do with it. Um, I don't know how old he was, but it's a gumdrop foot lotion. And I think the little, the little gnome on it is so freaking cute. It's so cute. <laughs> I haven't even smelled it, but it's, it's for Ma massage lotion into feet and between toes until absorbed. It has water, aqua, mineral oil, cedar alcohol, cedar acid, potassium, and all the other words, sodium hydroxide, and it contains red. So this is not food, do not eat, use only as directed. Do not apply on eyes, lips, or face. This is only for feet. This is was made by in New York of 2023. So hopefully this doesn't give me an allergic reaction. Because it has like different, different red like food coloring and stuff in it. Which I don't understand. I know a lot of food has red in it. And um... A lot of people are allergic to that, so I don't know if you want it to pause, but we're going to smell it. See, and it's still, <laughs> it's still shit. I wasn't expecting that. I'm not used to things having like this, because this reminds me of back in the olden days when I was growing up. Everything was sealed, no matter what it was. Nowadays, they don't care. They don't seal anything anymore, and it's annoying. opened I'm over here washing the dogs I don't know if I mentioned that that's why I'm in like this weird kitchen area <laughs> I'm watching the dogs from the window I didn't want to be downstairs because I'm like well if I set it here on the window seal with the window lighting I think this is great lighting Ooh, that actually smells delightful That smells delightful. See, and I kind of wanted to put it on my feet now. That smells really, really good. Gumdrop foot lotion. <laughs> I like the name and I like the little, the little picture. It's so cute. But I will review that as well because my feet are fine. Um, and then he, he won. I don't know if I, I. I'm forgetting. Why am I forgetting? He won bingo. A veteran won bingo, and he didn't know what to do with it, so he gave it to me, to my mother-in-law, to give to me. Um, this is in intensive repairing socks, coconut oil, milk extract. The H word, acid, smooth and softens feet, deeply moisturizing from heel to toe. One size fits most up to a woman's size 11. And it's one pair with re repairing cream. And I've never even tried this, never even heard of it. So I am going to be revealing it um, on this channel. Just not in this video today because like I said, I've already done my second round of my foot peel mask. And I'll put the foot peel mask here. Um, I've already done my round two, so my feet are pretty well great for this year already. <laughs> I don't know if I'm allowed to do any more foot peel mask or not, but um, 
he got this one. So I'm really excited because it's coconut. Coconut. It says leave on for 20 minutes. And they're literally like socks. Little directions. I'm really excited about this one too. Because I still have to do my petty in a box. But again, like I said, I've already done second round of my foot peel mask. So there will be videos with these foot peel masks. This one and my other one, petty in a box and stuff. To do all that. Just not today. And then he won. Got these little blue, baby blue turquoise socks, fuzzy socks. I mean, you know me, I love fuzzy socks and my feet always get cold because I have Reynards. Reynards. So I'm super excited to wear these. I kind of wanted to wear them today, but I'm already wearing my big fuzzy socks today. So um, maybe another day <laughs> I'll wear these, but I'm really excited to wear these. Anyway, anywho, let's get to what I, what y'all really came for for this video. But I wanted to add that in because I thought it was cute. And I'm very thankful and very blessed. Thank you, veteran, for giving me these. But again, my face is already washed. And I have to leave this on for 10 minutes. And I, like I said, I've used this Sunday and today's Friday. So this is my second time using it this week. I kind of forgot about it throughout the week. So I'm doing it today. <laughs> My face kind of, kind of needs it. And remember, like I said, see now you can actually see the color with this lighting. It's like a pink medicine, back in the olden days, pink petnobismal color, clay color. Like it's a really pink thing. Um, but leave on for... 10 minutes and go from there. I A lot of people will be like, well, you don't need it. Your face is already perfect. Well, yeah, I agree. Natural beauty is beautiful, but this also helps my face to be glowy and what's it called? Take out all the pores, clean, clean it, make it more shiny and glowy. So it helps. It really does help. And I still need to do my piercings, my getting my piercings for the first time, three of them for the first time. I did the belly button first and then the ears, but it was all on the same day. I still need to tell you guys about that story time. I believe I was 23 at the time when I got them. I'm 25 now and I've been here for two and a half years. So I believe I was 23 when I first got my uh, belly piercing and my ears for the very first time. I believe I was 23 because I'm 25 now. So if I'm doing math right. Um, so yeah, I still I can't stop thinking about it. And I know a lot of people would, would like to see it. And maybe that will attract more females on this channel <laughs> that interact with me. <laughs> But I, I've been meaning to tell you guys that for a very long time to um, talk about my piercings because I keep saying it in previous videos on this channel and I never have yet and it's been a while. So I really need to get down the business, lock in and find all the dates and times of everything that happened and my thoughts and my basically my entire, what's it called? My entire experience I guess with it and my thoughts on the same day when I got home because I did regret it when I got home but as the days go by I am glad I didn't rip it out <laughs> I'm glad I kept them all because I'm not in pain anymore I, I really wasn't in pain at all so it it was just the thing of it was so annoying and I had to do things differently until the healing process was done. I think that's good on my face. No, there's a little bit missing there. But yeah, um, so this is the second time I'm doing this clay mask reveal and I'll continue to do it until I guess I'm out. 
and actually see if it does anything different. Because I know I usually don't see results with anything until after a couple times I've used it. So I want to give you my genuine reaction to it if I really like it or not. I feel like I'm mi missing a lot. So... And I'm still keeping updated with my feet. I wanted to show you guys my feet and stuff with the this, what, which I will. I'm just gonna put my timer on for 10 minutes and then I'll be back to show you that. So it'd be kind of basically like a review um, and an update on my feet. And I'll add that clip that I took that one day that I took a shower, what my feet looks like, that'll be a, that clip, and then to my feet what they look like now, so it's not out of order, and not confusing, I guess. Okay, but there's my face, and my face is already getting tight. And I'll be back, I'm gonna set my timer, and I'll be back. He is back, hello. <laughs> and if I look weird or talk weird, it's because I got a mask on, obviously, because it's getting tighter. I wanted to show you what my feet look like. Now my feet are super, super soft because I've been adding like Eucrine on my feet and I've been peeling them. I've been using my She Sugar Scrub that I've used on my body and like my legs and stuff after I shave because I like soft skin. I love soft skin. My fiance loves soft skin as well. But me personally, I love to have hairless, soft skin. And I've been adding, like like I said, I've been using Eucrine lotion and She Sugar Scrub, the shower stuff that I've been using on my feet. And like scrubbing all the dead skin off and like peeling and all that. So my feet are like extra soft, softer than it would be if I just would just use the foot peel mask and then do nothing else like it'll just be soft but it won't be as extra extra soft like I want it to be but it, they are soft because of the foot peel mask and I love the foot peel mask so much and I wish I would get sponsored by them because I would love to do more reviews on each one and like different things if they do have different things I don't know if they would have different things or not other foot peel mask or if they only sell foot peel mask I don't know but I would love to be sponsored by them to try their more different products and like their different different scents, I guess. Because I've only tried the avocado and the strawberry one with them. I've only tried those. So I, I really want to try more. <laughs> but I don't have a job. I don't, I don't work. So trying to make YouTube my full time my full time um job but that's a lot of work because my my dream job is to make clothes and have my own clothing line that's what i want to do and i've been getting into crochet sorry this is like a big talking thing um i've been getting into crochet and i've been learning how to make a blanket because i'm making a blanket for my fiance I don't know where to look. I keep looking at the screen and keep looking over here. My camera's over here. <laughs> but I've been learning how to crochet and I'm just now trying to learn and understand how to make my second row on my blanket. So maybe crochet will be another side business, a side hustle that I could make money off of. I don't know yet because I wanted to make bucket hats out of crocheting. Um, but I don't know how to do that yet. I'm just a very beginner <laughs> and I'm getting so frustrated but I'm trying to learn and have patience with making my first blanket and it's going to be a huge blanket it's already like <laughs> so wide but I'm making one for my fiance I'm learning that I'm that's what my, I've been doing on my free time and then I also wanted to learn how to have my own business my own clothing line I love making clothes I always did that back in the past and I always sewed things and stuff but I don't have a sewing machine because that was my grand my Nana's sewing machine and I didn't want to take it with me all the way across the country 
So, um, and I, cause I didn't want it to get broke or I didn't think nobody else, nobody would be able to help me with it because they didn't know how to use one. So I, I still needed help and guidance on how to use one. And my Nana was always there. She's still alive. And I pray that she's still alive, but, um, I always had my mom and Nana to help me guide me and show me physically there on how to use it and what I'm supposed to do or what I'm doing wrong. So I don't have that here. <laughs> so I didn't do it. I didn't bring it with me. But um anyway, this is I'm trying to give you a different different angle. Okay, so I just got out of the shower, just got done showering. This is um my round two of doing the foot peel mask as Aura. <laughs> I need to clean that door. Every time I clean this door, she always makes it really, really, really dirty. The second I clean it, like this door does not stay clean because of her. <laughs> there she is. <laughs> yeah, I'm talking about you, Auras. Yeah, I'm talking about you. <laughs> um, but anyway, um, so I posted this four days ago. Uh, so I'm assuming this will be like four days later or something like that. Um... I don't know how long it's been since the first time I showed you guys from the beginning of the round two mask, but this is this round two mask and this is two months later from the first one that I did. Like I said, this mask, the second time around, it did not um, peel as bad or as much as the first time I did it. Now my fiance just mentioned to me that his feet are peeling really, really, really bad like lots and lots i'm like yeah that's the way mine was when i first did it too but mine aren't peeling that much because again this is my second time doing it so it didn't peel as much or as bad as his are right now <laughs> and as mine was the first time but this is what they look like for now and i will continue to keep you guys updated on this journey because i really like I was gonna say, what is that as a hair? I really like these foot peel mask. I'm really enjoying these. They, see, and I'm peeling back here. They really make my feet so soft. And I don't use my she sugar scrub and all that to make my skin peel, like to get all the dead skin off. Yeah, I know that's what the purpose of them, she sugar scrubs are for in the shower. But I like to use it only because, mainly because it makes my skin so, so freaking soft. And you know me, I love having soft skin. And I know my, my fiance loves soft skin. And I just personally love having soft skin. I cannot stand itchy, raw, bumpy, dry skin. You know what I mean? I, I like to feel myself. <laughs> I like to be really soft I don't know because I really can't deal with um I'm trying to show you the side of my foot but I really just can't sorry for a lot of movement but yeah there's my feet I love soft skin that's just me who I am so yep there's that say bye Aurora's here are what my feet are looking like. There's another big callus there. I don't think it's gonna be peeling off. I think my feet are done, pretty well done being peeled. I think that was my right foot. Here is my left foot. This is a little bit peeling. I've been walking on my feet a lot and yeah, there's like a lot of calluses. Uh, it's peeling a little bit, I mean, on the side here. But like the top, the top of them are not peeling, my ankles aren't, but behind, here, let me show you a different angle, hold on. But here's my feet now, um, I am peeling back here though, so, on my right foot, my left foot, there's like nothing really, just a little bit there, and that's about it. Maybe a little bit peeling there. A little bit of peeling there, but other than that, they're basically done peeling, I guess. They're basically done peeling. So, let's see. 
um, why it stopped, but hello, I'm back. <laughs> so, I'm going to put this gum thing, gumdrop foot lotion on my feet. Ooh, it smells really good. <laughs> I can't get over the smell. It smells amazing. And it's kind of like watery. Well, it's literally like water, water texture. Oh no, it's raining. Hold on, I gotta grab the dogs. Hold on. It's hailing. <laughs> oh no. But I really, this is like really soft. This stuff is really soft. Don't you dare. No. Lay down. Lay down. Lay down. I need to keep an eye on you. I don't trust you. You cannot be trusted. He likes to tear up everything. If you know, if you're a husky family, I have two. The hair never stops. The tearing up never stops. <laughs> but this is like literally like water texture. You can see that, but I like it. It's making my feet soft. This headband is itching me so much. It's like water texture, I like it. My feet feel like, I, like I said, doing all of this saves you money because I literally feel like I'm at a spa. Like doing all these feet, foot peel masks, these like putting in a box, this one with the fuzzy socks, like I feel like I'm literally out of spa putting foot lotion on, um, your current on, like, you gotta, don't forget in between the toesies, um, doing everything. Like I literally feel like I'm out of spa and my feet are doing so well with everything that I've tried so far and it saves you a lot of money than going to a Okay. My timer's up. <laughs> it stopped me. It cut me off because my timer's up for my pee clay mask. But anyway, um, what I was saying was, oh my, it's pouring down really hard. Um, I never been to a spa, but I would love to go to a spa to get a massage and stuff. That's what my me and my fiance was thinking about for like a day, like when we have enough money to save up. Because the last one I looked up, it was like two thousand dollars for a massage. Um like a face thing and everything like it was like two thousand dollars the cheapest one i found was like a thousand dollars the cheapest one i found was like a thousand dollars to go to the spa for like it's expensive because i ain't going to no like trashy sketchy one you know what i mean like i don't want to go to a one where it's got bad reviews it have ropes in it whatever they're called, rodents and bad service and stuff that makes you have allergic reaction and you would have to go to the hospital for it. Like, no, thank you. I want to go to a good one that I know have good reviews. They got great products that they use, great things that they use. And I want to get a good deal, good deal package. You know what I mean? So, um, I gotta go take this off. But yeah, I'm really liking this foot, this foot lotion. And sorry, my feet are turning so white because I'm so cold right now. <laughs> but yeah, I really like this. I give this a 10 out of 10 so far. And if I do have an allergic reaction or I do notice something go wrong, I will update you guys on it. But if there's no clip about it, then it went great. You will know, you will know. <laughs> so I really, I really like this foot thing it smells good and a little like i said it feels like a spa let's go to the bathroom and let's wash this off so i wanted to show you what it looks like close up because it looks like black like black pores like black holes or whatever since i'm already in good lighting might as well show you what it really truly looks like when it's done drying and done processing because so i'm trying to give you like a full everything if you know what i mean full genuine 
what it looks like the whole process i'm trying to show you the full process that's why i'm like i try to wish i had an sword on my phone kind of missed stuff there but to show you guys what my feet look like for that but we will go to the bathroom and we'll wash it off there's my duskers <laughs> look at them you funny. <laughs> you funny. You crack me up, dude. You crack me up. I love you. I love you. On to the bathroom we go. Let's go. We're back to the shitty lighting. I'm sorry. <laughs> so I like being in that window. That window is really nice to have lighting for. I realized that and I'm going to be using that and continuing to use that lighting. If it's like a good day. <laughs> get it. But like I said, it feels like mud. It feels like wet clay if you've ever messed with wet clay before. But it feels like, but I swear it's worth it because it makes your skin so soft. And glowy and cleans out the pores and stuff. It doesn't stink. It doesn't smell bad after you wash your face the first time and before you put the pink clay mask on you have to make sure your face is dry and cleaned so you wash your face dry your face and then put the pink mask clay mask on that's what it says on the bottle and then we'll go back to better lighting so you can see my face <laughs> before we before we go back to the great lighting uh this watermelon nature oil face mask i haven't been using at all this week only because i've been using the pink clay mask and i wanted to truly genuinely feel how the pink clay mask does on its own like separate because i know when i do combinations you don't know which one is doing the job which one's doing what so that's why i always like do it separate but um i wanted to see how the pink clay mask is but the pink clay mask like i said you can only use minimum two times a week this one you can use daily and this is a, another face mask that i got off amazon it's the watermelon nature well because i love their lavender uh face moisturizer their face moisturizer is amazing and i don't know how many times i've used this already but um so far i like it so but this is a daily face mask you can use a day daily if you'd like. I don't know if you can see that, but <laughs> that's what it's doing today. It is raining. It was hailing earlier. I guess it's just raining now. No, it's it's literally hailing. Look at the grass. That's literally hail. The dirt. I'm glad I pulled him in when I did. Oh my goodness. Look at that. Look at that. It's like flooding already back there. That's crazy. Anyway, back to this. Here's my face. What it's looking like. Like, I look glowy. Like, I literally look glowy and I love that. I love that. Because natural beauty is beautiful. And that's why I, want, I wanted to try again my mascara and see if I can do better. <laughs> and practice what my uh, best friend Janie did. But I feel like that's too chaotic and too much to put in this video. And this video is probably already really, really long. I didn't want to do that. So I thought maybe I'd do that on like a separate video. And like practice my mascara again for the second time. But I didn't want to do that in this video because I feel like it was too much and too much chaotic and I'm like already cleaning my face. So I was like, well, if I did the mascara in this one, I would have to do the mascara first and then wash my face and wash my eyes. And that's like a long process. And then get to the point of the video of this and this. So I just like this too long. But I like my face. Look at my face. I'm like literally glowing. I love it. See, that's why I like natural beauty. Less money. It's free. And you look beautiful already. And I don't know. I just feel like I'm not eating the makeup. <laughs> and my skin is naturally beautiful. Like, it's... 
gonna be great when I'm old, I guess, because I haven't, I never wear makeup. So, like I said, I've only tried it once when I was really little, and then now I'm trying mascara, but like that's the only thing I've tried. But when I do, when I do go to raves, I've never been to a rave either. But when I do go to rave, I want to do like the the glitter and like the gems, the body gems and stuff for it. Because I was supposed to go to EDC this this year. Now didn't have enough money. It's way too expensive. Way too expensive. But I was supposed to go to EDC for my first rave. Sadly, can't. But, um, yeah, I never been to a rave either. But I was going to go. Because I need outfits and, um, body gems. And I wanted to do, like, glitter for my face. Sadly, I can't. But yeah, I've never been to a rave in my life either, so good luck with that. Yeah, it's peeling a little bit on my big toe. But yeah, I really like, I like this. This is nice. My face is amazing, I love it. Because I feel like the pink clay mask, it like does it more deeper. Like it actually pulls out the dirt, pulls out the pores, the stuff in the pores, like it'll make your pores empty almost. And I, you can't do that with like just washing your face because you only wash your face on like the top, like the top layer and like you're not actually deep cleaning the face. I feel like this Mary Kay pink clay mask is like literally deep cleaning your face and it's pulling all that nasty stuff out, grind and sweat and dirt. Dusty. Oh, never mind. You're fine. You're fine. No, you're fine. You're okay. <sighs> you're fine. You're fine. I, I didn't know where you went. You're okay, buddy. I love you. You can go lay down. You can go lay down. <laughs> he's, under the, he's underneath the table. See that? <laughs> Hi. I love you. I love you. <laughs> He's my buddy. You can go lay down if you want. You can go lay down. You can go lay down. You can go lay down. I don't even know what I was talking about. But uh, I really like that face mask. Pink clay, pink clay mask. And this foot stuff. This is great. I don't know where you can get it. I feel like you can get it at like Dollar General, Dollar Tree. Like something like that. Like that's what it reminds me of. I don't know. I don't even know where you can get this. I guess like Dollar General, something like that. Fuzzy socks, you can literally get it anywhere. <laughs> but yeah, I give it a 10 out of 10. So far, I'm like, I can't stop looking at myself. I'm so pretty. <laughs> I love natural beauty. Anyway, I love you guys so, so, so much. And I hope you guys have a great rest of your weekend. A great start off your weekend. And I hope it ends great. And I hope you guys have a great day a great friday and i love you guys so 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 much and thank you for watching please like subscribe comment down below what any other videos you would like me to do um potentially i can't go out and buy stuff like i said i got this for free i won in a giveaway this i was gifted as by a veteran because he didn't know he won he won the bingo and didn't know what to do with it so he gave it to me so I've been gifted these, um, gifted this. So like, I don't have money to go out and buy things, but comment down below what videos you would like to hear, talk about, I don't know, me to do. Cause I, I'm w really wanting to do my piercing video, like my first time experience on that, like a story time. Other than that, like that's the only other idea that I have right now. And yeah, I love you guys so, so much. Gotta keep the head up high and that smile big and bright. And I love you guys so, so much. I want you to be here. I love you just the way you are. And please be safe. Bye.